Under our best model of the universe, about 25% of our universe is made up of this something we call dark matter. We think dark matter is a thing because we have an absolute deluge of data that says it does. But the story, it starts with Vera Rubin, an astronomer at the Carnegie Institution in the late 60s and early 70s who measured the rotation curves of galaxies. Measuring how fast stars and gas in galaxies was rotating around its galactic centre and how that speed changes with the distance from the centre of the galaxy. What everyone expected looking at Newton and Einstein's laws of gravity was that the outsides of galaxies would rotate slower than the inner regions, much like how Mercury orbits the Sun faster than Pluto. Vera Rubin did not find this. She found the rotation curves of galaxies were flat. Outer regions were rotating at the same speed that inner regions were, and more than 50% of the mass in galaxies would actually have to be in a dark halo around the galaxy to explain these rotation curves. Fast forward a few decades and this so-called dark matter is a core part of our best model of the universe. It explains the masses we measure from observations of galaxies and galaxy clusters, and when we include it in simulations, it gives us a universe that looks like our own. The only problem is, we have no idea what it is.